Dan Springer live for us in Bangor, Washington. Dan, thank you. Allison. All right, have you ever watched the show Gossip Girl? If so, you know it's a show that glorifies the lives of privileged New York City teenagers, packing power, credit cards, and a flair for risque behavior. This is the cast whose characters sparked controversy after three racy ads were released last year. Well, now parents are outraged over the very latest suggestive commercial. Look at this. I have a surprise for you. On three, one, two, three. You two will want to kiss. Just like that? This was a huge mistake. Well, the Parents Television Council is writing a letter to the CW Network asking that they preempt the show's season finale next week. And it goes on to say Gossip Girl routinely depicts teenage characters engaging in promiscuous and consequence free sexual behavior, and that's bad enough. But will you now be complicit in establishing a precedent and expectation that teenagers should engage in behaviors associated primarily with adult films? Well, we called CW for a response and they had no comment. Alicia Quarles is the global entertainment director for the Associated Press. Alicia, thanks for being here. My pleasure. All right, so that I want to get back to that commercial that yes. we just yes. saw because it's very suggestive and it suggests that we will be seeing something about a threesome among teenagers. But what makes the Parents uh, Television Council think that the show will be more graphic? Because it's fairly abstract. Well, this is the problem. The Parents Television Council maybe should have seen the episode before they put out this warning. We don't know what the episode's going to be about. Maybe it's not going to be about a threesome. We'll have to wait and see. But still, it suggests, I think at the end it says OM3, suggesting yeah. a threesome. There was something else in there that suggested a threesome. This isn't Showtime. This it's, isn't HBO. This is showtime. broadcast television. It Where is. is the line? Well, the line is Gossip Girl says that their average viewer is 27 years old. So they're saying these people are adult enough to understand this, to make their own decisions. And at the end of the day, it's about ratings. They love the fact that we're on here talking about this. They've done this before, as you said, with those racy billboards. Uh, they had a couple of episodes ago as Ed West week's character had a homosexual scene so they're known for kind of being cutting edge yes but let's get back to the point that okay. you just made okay. which is in the past when the parents television council has brought this up they've said look we're not really targeting teenagers come on it's about high school students who do they think is watching this well this is very true I mean it is about high school students but they're saying their point is is that you have to monitor your own children so maybe this is a warning to parents they know this episode's coming up it's gonna be out there if you don't want your child to watch turn off the TV keep them far away Away that night. Um, so the PTC, the mm -hmm. Parents Television Council, wants the network to preempt this coming episode. It's their finale. Right. Does a TV show ever do that and really bend to parents' um, pressure like that? It, very rare, and it's because it's about the bottom line. There are ad revenues attached to this television show, so I highly doubt a station's going to say, you know what, morally we're not going to air this because they'll lose out on a whole lot of ad revenue. All right, we'll see what happens next week. We Alicia Quarles, thanks for coming in. My pleasure. Trace. Mm, Trace doesn't have a camera. Oh, I do. He's looking Ever over here. Ever feel like you're being watched, Trace, even when there's not a camera on you? <laughs> That's probably because you are. Folks you've never met are checking you out online.